and there's like smoke starting to come out the front door. Ashley Thompson was the first in her family to spot the danger across the street. The home of a longtime friend was on fire and she was inside. Ashley and her family quickly sprang into action to save her. We were trying to get in the front door, but there was just too many flames. So then that's when I'm thinking, like, I remember there was the garage door right there. So that's when I ran around and I just started pounding on it, yelling for it. I'm like thinking, like, okay, do I open it? Do I not open it? So I'm like, I just took a chance. So I just swung it open and all this black smoke just comes out, hits me in the face. And then by the time that happened, I'm like yelling for her. I can't see her, but I can hear her in there. What made the situation even more desperate is that the woman who lives here is disabled and uses a wheelchair. Like I wasn't leaving her in there. So then we're all trying to find something. I'm like thinking maybe like a blanket or something just to cover up with. And then my dad just, he just ran in there and he just got down and army crawled in there. So he got real low. So, cause my mom was like, get real low, Tim, get real low. So, He's army crawling in there and he was able to get her. Ashley's dad, Tim, was at work today, just like nothing happened. But Ashley says he was very brave to go in and save their friend. Oh, he would do anything for anybody. So, and I know a lot of people are like, you know, give him a lot of credit for it, but he would, he would do it again in a heartbeat. And so would the rest of this family. She means a lot to us. So I'm just, we're, we're all glad she's okay.